So I'm here with BTCC driver Nick Foster. So Nick, last time out at Alton, how would you sum that up? Alton? Um, yeah, I enjoyed Alton. We, we had a, a good race one. Uh, I think we came in P8. And we were having a very solid um, race two and we were in P8. And then the throttle cable broke, unfortunately, on the car. Um, which was a, was a big shame, really, because that really put us at the back of the grid for race three. And we just had to battle through and just do the best we could. We got 15th, I think. We had the most overtakes of the weekend. Um, but the car was good and the car was strong. But um, it was a shame about that throttle cable. But it's one of those things. Now, you say you uh, had the most overtakes over the weekend. Everyone seemed to be struggling with overtake to uh, overtake. So overtaking at all is a big accomplishment. Yeah, no, well, the Alton Park is a difficult circuit anyway. I love it. It's a great circuit, but it's it's quite narrow. It's quite fast. And I think the change from the, the hairpin that we used to have, uh, which did actually open up a few overtake opportunities um, with doing the island circuit, closed those down. So I think it was, a, it was a little bit disappointing for the crowd. So we'll see what the organisers do for next year. Now, to this weekend at Croft, you've... Uh qualified 13th for you were uh, happy of that should have been a bit further up i'm honest um, we got bought a couple of times in, a, in in one of the runs where we were a bit quicker which would have which would have probably found us up in the top 10 but we are where we are and we're just gonna have to fight from from there last year you know we started in p12 last year and we got a fourth in race one um, so we're just gonna have to see how it goes but we're certainly gonna be battling hard that's for sure now this weekend is the first weekend that the rear wheel drive cars have a longer first gear. Yeah. Now we know that's going to affect you uh, off the start, but do you, do you uh, think that's going to help you or give you another disadvantage over the course of a lap? Yeah, apparently the BMW car is such a good car, we have to start in second now, so to try and help all the others are a bit slower. Um, so I don't, I don't think it's going to help, but um, we'll just have to wait and see what the, the penalty is going to be. Um, we're just we're, we're going to see tomorrow, aren't we? Nobody knows really yet. Now, uh, finally, after this weekend, this is your halfway point. Uh, have you, have you um, found the first half of the season? Because I know you're up on where you were last year, but I'm guessing that must give you a lot of positives over the course of the first half of the year. Yeah, the, you know the, the team has done a great job with the car. The cars, the cars, very good, it's very solid. We've had a, we've had a few unlucky bits. We, we unfortunately had a had a drive through penalty um, at Brands, which cost us dear. We had an incident at Thruxton, which again in the race two, and then we had another incident at Alton Park. So I think we've had a bit of bad luck up to now. I'm hoping the luck might change this weekend, but we'll have to wait and see. Okay, thank you very much for your time, Nick, and very good luck for uh, tomorrow. Thank you, Lewis. It's a pleasure.